guys, we are back with more Star Wars The Clone Wars. We're on Season 4, Episode 13. It's called Escape from Kadavo. So, I know you guys were all over me about the species for Ahsoka. It's the Togruta. Hope I said that right. I, I kind of knew what it was, or at least it began with a T. I knew that, but I didn't know how to pronounce it. So, I didn't really want to pronounce it on camera and pretty much embarrass myself. And you guys, if I would have pronounced it wrong, you guys would have been all over me about that. In a way, even though I got it right, I put it, in, I put it on Google Translate, and you know I've heard it, and I know how to say it to Gruta. Hope I said that right. Let's. <laughs> well, I, I'm probably gonna get a comment saying, you know, you still didn't say it right, but who, who cares? I, I said it. Look, I did it. I did it right, man. <laughs> but I mean, look, the last episode was just amazing. The, the parts that stuck out to me was, you know, Anakin's dark side. This choke the hell out of that Zygerian. That was intense. It really was intense and it just, you, you don't want Anakin to be that way, but a lot of you guys are saying this is like the beginning of him becoming Darth Vader, like the, you know, the road to becoming Darth Vader. It's just, I just don't like to see that from him. I really, really don't. I, kind, I just, it just doesn't sit right with me, but at the same time, it is cool seeing that, how it, it's just an intense part. From the, the last part of the episode, it, you know, seeing what that rat, Zygerian, I guess, or whatever he is, dropping the Togrudas, Ahsoka's pe people, down like the death hole was just insane. Another part that actually stuck out to me in the episode, that was just insane, it was crazy. I just can't imagine the type of pain they had to go through. And they pro some of them probably had heart attacks before they even hit the ground. That's just, it's terrible. It was it was so terrible, but this, the whole episode was just phenomenal. I loved it. I really did. It was, it was really engaging. It was really... Just awesome in every way. I mean, let's just get into this next episode. I'm looking forward to seeing the Kadavo. But guys, let's get into this next episode. I'm looking forward to you checking this out. I don't know how Anakin's even going to convince the Zygerian woman to that I'm on her side type of thing. I have no idea. And I think while he's distracting her, Obi-Wan has to save, you know, Ahsoka's people, basically. But for you guys, let's just check out this next episode. Great hope can come from small sacrifices. This queen who plots to rebuild her empire of oppression. Now even Obi-Wan Kenobi must come to terms with a life in chains. Uh, now he's a slave. Damn, they got him working. Obi-Wan Kenobi, once a Jedi master, now a Jedi slave. <laughs> what a creep. <laughs> it has already begun to affect these poor people. Speech is forbidden. I'm sorry. You'll be punished. Man. No, stop. It's my mistake. Leave him alone. Forgive me, Master. <laughs> Bunch of freaking asses, man. Keep away from me. Jedi only make things worse. Are you serious? Count Dooku. Here he comes. Long have Sith empires been built upon the backs of slaves. I assure you the Queen's defiance will not sour your plans, Master. If she fails to see the error of her ways, End her rule. What? If you vow loyalty to me, I will free He's your like, friends. He's like, what? I'm trying to get the fuck out of here. He's trying to get out of there. I thought the Jedi were selfless, placing the needs of others before their own. I bring word. Count Dooku is on his way here. <sighs> Sooner than anticipated. He about to kill you. Make That's what's about driver. to happen. I trust you not to run away. I don't run away from anything, your highness. R2's there, though. What? Get off, you miserable tin can. <laughs> Get down there and find that Jedi. Yes, sir. I'm about to throw your... I'm about to throw him off! Oh, he... He got lucky. Work, pal. Find Ahsoka? I wasn't expecting you, Count. Not without an invitation. But I was invited. Your power over him is an illusion. You forget. I was once a Jedi myself. 
You have little in common with Anakin. Here are my plans for the Jedi. Unfortunately, Dooku's right about that. You have an right illusion. Now, she at does. my facility in the Kadavo system, Obi-Wan Kenobi is in despair. The gnawing fear that he will never be able to take action will grow in Kenobi's heart. As he cannot help those around him, his spirit will break, and he will be mine. Imagine an army of Jedi in your service. See, my goal is not the enslavement of the Jedi Order, but its extermination. I've come to supervise their execution. Perform it if necessary. Summon Skywalker. Really? Are you serious? She doesn't want to do all that. Well, hello, Master. Damn, he's strong. Are you okay? I sense a disturbance in the force. It's Dooku. I need you to get our ship. Here, take this comm link. Why can Obi Wan do that? Why can he just the queen break knows it where off? Is. Hold on to that comm link and wait for my signal. Perhaps your prime minister will. A tie. What does he mean? I'm sorry, Your Majesty. You're not fit to be queen any longer. A tie, you traitor! I'll make you both pay for this treachery. No. Oh! Punishment for a slave who disobeys her master. That's enough, Dooku. One more step, and I will end her life. <laughs> He's like, what? Too easy. The queen. She was murdered by the Jedi. What? That's our signal. Take your vengeance. You got the heck out of there. He's saving her, really. Skywalker. <laughs> I am a slave. Just as you are. <sighs> Damn. Someone wishes to speak with you. Great. Obi-Wan Kenobi. In chains once again, I see. Count Dooku. Still afraid to get your hands dirty? I would gladly make an exception in your case, my friend. Say a proper farewell before Keeper Argos puts you to death. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Much for our ride home. What now? We get through the old fashioned way. Yes. If he does not surrender, the slaves will be terminated in his name. I'm glad to see you, but I'm afraid our host feels otherwise. Oh, you can't make everyone happy, Master, but I've had enough bargaining with slave drivers. Anakin, you must realize this is a fight you cannot win alone. Who said I was alone? I got the Republic here. Call them up. Hey! That's the flow! Start blasting this place up. Rex, now! About time. Thank you! Okay, I knew you could do that. Ooh. Oh, damn it. Nice. Bye. That got him. Good work, General. Keep your focus, Wolfhawk. Watch out for those towers. Ooh! He got hit in the head. <laughs> they want to beat their ass. <laughs> They're electrifying. Oh. <laughs> they better kill that rat soon. Kill him. Oh, no. What? <laughs> the controls are destroyed, Master Plo. I'm gonna go help my people. I'll see if I can buy some time. 
<laughs> Ooh. Damn, savage. We're all clear, Master Plo. Bring the cruiser down to the landing pad. Cancel that order, Master. There's no way to get the people out of the holding cell. We need to have the cruiser move in underneath the facility. Damn it. Oh, my God. Huh? Oh. Come now, Master Kenobi. I know a Jedi won't kill an unarmed man. Bastard. He will. I'm no Jedi. Oh my god! That is so messed up. <laughs> Jetpacks! Yes! I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed from her. Who was that? Cruiser is clear. All gunships. Fire. Oh, they're all going. Going down the hole. Thank you, Jedi, and the Republic for saving our life. We've gotten your people to safety. Indeed. Master Plo standing like a proud How father. <laughs> Might I have a word in private? Surviving this will only strengthen the people. Perhaps. And perhaps the people of Kirosh will also join the Republic. I think that's a wise choice, Governor. This is a good episode, guys. It's so good. Okay, thank the freaking Lord that Rat's dead. I'm glad Rex threw that spear at him. He's like, well, I'm no Jedi anyway, so I don't care. I'm going to kill you anyway, so that's easy enough. Dude, you see the way he hit the screen in his face with the chair? <laughs> okay, I'm not going to lie. That was pretty freaking funny when I saw that. I was like, and did you see that Tagruga girl would ever fall down like and scream? And like, well, I'm like, what were you doing? I get it's scary to jump on a rope and it's, you know, kind of far. I get in that perspective, but you go out there and then you fall down. And now so got to save you. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. That kind of annoyed me a little bit from that part. Zygerian, uh, queen is dead. You know, Count Dooku did choke her to death somewhat, but, you know, she was already pretty much half dead by, you know, at the time when Anakin saved her. Obviously, I don't, I don't know. Anakin, I don't know if he cared about her or didn't. I'm pretty sure he did not care at all because he did leave her body in the ship and it disintegrated in there. <laughs> just like so, I'm pretty sure he does not care. I mean, this episode was so damn good. The battles, the in in the planet, you know, with this that was really cool. You know, with Master Plo, you know, in the tower, you know, seeing the towers shoot everywhere. That was just freaking awesome. <laughs> you can see Master Plo standing there. I said like he looked like a proud father. You know, has uh, his hand over Ahsoka. Pretty, that's what he looks like. He looks like a proud father to me, honestly. Well, number one, Count Dooku and, you know, the Emperor did not want the Zygerian Queen to have Anakin on her side. So it's either you get rid of the Jedi or you die and, you know, she pretty much died from that point. Guys, please post your comments down below. Tell me what you guys think about this awesome episode. If you guys enjoyed this reaction, don't forget to leave a thumbs up on the video. If you're new around here, don't forget the subscribe button. And also follow my social medias. And guys, check out the Patreon page. The full episode will be on there. Guys, stay focused, stay motivated. I'll see you guys next Clone Wars.